I'm Tia. Welcome to Clayford College. I was in your shoes not long ago, super excited and a little daunted at the thought of starting secondary school. Get ready, as over the next few minutes, we are going to explore Year 7 at Clayford College. Excuse me, Dr C, do you have a moment? What are your top tips for students moving into secondary school? Great question, Tia. One of the fantastic things about Clayfield is that every student is known, valued and understood. My top three tips would be, first of all, have a go. It's really important that you take on every opportunity. Second, be yourself. We want to see the real you. And my final tip is it's a team effort. It's a partnership between you, the school and home. Thanks for your advice, Dr C. Oh, Mr D, just who I was looking for. What would you say to students who are feeling a little nervous about the move to secondary school? We're here to make the transition into year seven as smooth as possible. Our first priority is relationship building. So they'll get a year 11 buddy, attend a three day camp as part of our outdoor education program, belong to a house, attend PC groups each morning with students from year six to 12, and enjoy this amazing space dedicated just for them all as part of Care at Clayfield. But what is Care at Clayfield? It's our whole of school wellbeing framework. As part of Care at Clayfield, Year 7 students will hear from expert presenters presenting on topics such as cyber safety, healthy habits, developing resilience, and handling disappointment. Thanks, Mr. D. See you at lunchtime. Whoa. Ms. Mohan, how is secondary school different to primary school from an academic point of view? Students may notice key differences, such as different teachers for different subjects and moving around the campus for lessons. There will be a gradual increase in homework and assessment, and students will be allowed to use their own devices as part of our BYOT program. Now, Year 7 is a foundational year, and it is our focus to instill in students the belief that anything is possible. What subjects are offered in Year 7? This broad exposure will help students to identify their interests and passions and will assist in the selection of electives later in their secondary school years. You're right. I'm definitely choosing biology and psychology in Year 10 now. Ms Eagle, can you share some learning highlights in the Year 7 curriculum? Well, there's lots to encourage academic risk taking. Here's a taste of what students can experience both within and outside the classroom. Wow, so many exciting activities. Now to dive into all of Clayfield's co-curricular opportunities. There really is something here for everyone. We belong to QG SSSA Sporting Competition, the wide range of sports, and we have our elite sporting program looking after our state and national representative athletes. As part of our award-winning music program at Clayfield College, students have the opportunity to perform in our choirs, instrumental groups, and chamber ensembles. We also have an extensive private tuition program on offer. Students in our senior ensembles have the opportunity to tour internationally every three years. And then there's Art Box, Chess Club, Debating, Duke of Edinburgh Scheme, STEM Science Club, Ignite Science Club, Christian Fellowship Group, the TED edX Educational Experience, Debating. Oh, did I say that? Are you keeping up to you? Where have we made oh, it? And we have service trip? trips, we have international cultural exchanges, we have overseas exchanges. Stop. Time's up. Okay. Now, Tia, I've got a question for you. If you were to describe Clayfield College in one sentence, what would it be? Hmm. It's a place where everyone knows your name. <laughs>